What's good everybody welcome back to the channel welcome back to another video man if you hear like air or whatever obviously i'm in the car and it's hot as hell it's 109 degrees today and i am not turning this air off so i'm gonna speak up for the one time for the one time you know what i mean and of course i got like when i edit it i can turn it down and whatever but <laughs> this air is staying on but today as you can see by the title uh i'm gonna screen record it for y'all so y'all can see it too y'all right, should be able to see it over there now but new video and gym mat death released of course you know recipes of george floyd um black lives do matter you know all lives matter but black lives matter more right now but um oh yeah before the video gets started like comment and subscribe man please and thank you i truly appreciate it but yeah back to this um it's it's sad because it's i feel like you know, they always got something to cover up about somebody, about something. You know, even the Michael Brown incident, this this boy was laying in the street for over four hours until he got taken away. And not even in an ambulance. He was taken away in a damn SUV, a black SUV. Like, what? So that made me think, was this nigga even really took to the hospital or what? You know what I mean? But I just find this stuff real sad how you now you got new evidence of the gym mat death knowing this little boy ain't rolled himself up in the gym mat like come on now man y'all gotta be smarter we about to uh get into this video because i want to see what they talking about and what is going on because this right here this is sad oh this is sad Okay, we can turn the music off because I don't want to listen to that. Anderson, the John. Okay. All right. <laughs> All right, we're going to get right into the video to see what they got. Well, Anderson, the Johnsons were hoping that this video would give them some answers. There was even a hashtag on Twitter, give us the tapes. But it appears that this video is only providing more questions and very few answers. We've got a couple of clips from these hours of video we've watched. Let's look at the first you see one. You crazy? Now they got new clips. Where was these clips at years ago when this boy died? Now y'all want to have new clips. See, man, that's that shit shows Kendrick walking in from the right side of your screen there. He's behind another student. And as soon as he runs out, you see that student disappears and a couple of other students disappear, uh, appear rather. It's from one image to the next with no explanation of how those students got to that position or where the student at that red shirt went. Now we blurred their faces because they're minors in this video and the next. Let's go to the next one. You can see Kendrick at the bottom right of the screen. He's walking at first and then he runs out of the frame. And just like the first video, other students just appear. No explanation of how they got to that point. You don't see them walk in. Y'all understand. These people had this tape for all these years. And now that people are saying reopen the case, of course they meddled with it. Come on now. P these people have possession of the tape. It was probably the damn faculty who wrote the boy up in the gym, man, if you really want to be honest. Because how is it how he disappeared and then somebody else appeared? Like, they tamper with it. We've not edited these videos to just kind of put one image next to the other. This is how we receive them from the sheriff's office today. Because they tamper with it. So the, the video seems to be to be jumping they around. The, you're saying those aren't edits. Is that, I mean, it, I assume it's a motion sensor camera. Is that the way it's supposed to work? That it may take a few seconds for an image no. to register? That was our first question. When we see the images, especially of Kendrick with all these hours of video, it's like, well, what happened at the end of this and how did these students appear? Was this video edited? So we reached out to both the school that owns the cameras that recorded it and then the sheriff's office, which had a, a copy of it, which supplied it to us. I want to read you the statements. First from the school district, an attorney for Lowndes County Schools says simply, we, what we produce to the sheriff is a raw feed with no edits. And then from the attorney for the sheriff's office, my client has confirmed that the video was not altered or edited by anyone within the Lowndes County Sheriff's so Office. They, so they cameras must really be boo-boo cheeks because how how he disappeared and other students appeared. 
Unless we living in an age where, bitch, they go to a witchcraft school and they study in disappearance acts. Because how does how this even... Don't even make sense. They both maintain that what we see is exactly what was recorded. What, what about the corner where the gym mats are or where, where Kendrick's body w was ultimately exactly. found? I mean, that seems to be the key place. We've exactly. known there was a camera there. You saw the video from that camera today. What did you see? Yeah, this is the most important camera of all 36, and I want to show you the video. It's blurry. Of all 36 cameras, a video that was provided, this angle is blurry. It's almost impossible to make out any of the faces. And if you look at the corner, it's the top left of the image. Those are the mats uh, in which uh, Kendrick Johnson was found. What you don't see is the top of the mats. And we know why that's important, because sheriff's deputies say that he climbed in through the top of the mat. They say that the students who found him were uh, playing on top of those mats. And in this video, because you can't see that image, you can't see that. Also, you know, we saw from one image to the next in the other videos, from looking at this, we see students playing basketball. And then a few frames later, we see what appears to possibly be the nurse running in. Then we see someone running through with a, a gurney. So there is, we know from the file uh, of the, the investigative file, there are activities and there are events between these, but we just don't see them through what is the only blurry image, the blurry angle of all three dozen cameras that were provided by the school district and the sheriff's office. So I'm, I'm a little confused. I mean, is it, we saw Kendrick running and from one angle, it, the, the, the camera on the mat, does that show him approaching the mats at any time and is there anybody else that shows up there is activity in the uh, hours of a video there but it's so blurry and so much is happening in that corner there are bleachers there and students uh, we know from the file would sit in that area they the police say that they would play in that area but because we can't see the top of the mats from the image we can't tell if anyone ever went on top and when they went on top um, and we don't see uh, I Kendrick see that because it's just making me mad. Like, y'all don't think they put that into play? Y'all don't think they set that up and made it? Like, come on now, bro. They had these tapes for years, bro. Y'all got to realize that. And they want you to believe what they want you to believe. That's why I don't believe this. I see on, on social media, on the news. Just because it's on the news don't mean it's real. That's why you need to do your own research. That's but I promise you, they're going to crack the case. And I promise you, it's probably going to be somebody from the faculty. Because there's no way this boy rolled himself up in the mat. That don't even make sense. That don't even make zero sense. It's like they just say something to put in your head. Just like with the George Floyd thing. They talking about, oh, yeah, they, 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 uh, him and the cop have bumped heads. So it, it's something there. They work together. Like, what? That's not an excuse for him killing him. They just try to make stuff up so you can believe it. But if you believe it, you you gullible as hell because I'm not believing nothing. I see, like, all this, this, what we just watched, it didn't make sense to me, like, at all. But if y'all enjoyed this video, go ahead, like, comment, subscribe, man. I truly appreciate it. Catch me in my next video. Peace out.